break a baby like a break a babe. Well, oh, it did work this time. Fork. Okay, well, welcome back. We are here with Sonic 4 Episode 1. I am actually enjoying doing this, but we are going to get started with Mad Gear Zone right about. Okay, I'll start. Mad Gear Zone. Thought Derek missing your base. Let's do this! So, yeah. That's actually my favorite act <laughs> for this zone right here. I do like this musical track as well. Recently got my hands on the um soundtrack for both episode one and two. Soundtrack's okay, very repetitive though. I believe I mentioned that in my um <sighs> review for Sonic Four. Episode 2, GameSmitch.com. The music is just. I feel it repeats the same 20 seconds. And doesn't. I don't know. It's like it's, they're trying to play it safe. And though it works the first time through, second time through, it's just like. Ugh, I want to hear some more. But again, it's not a bad soundtrack. Just very repetitive. Bit of a daredevil moment. Oh. In case I didn't notice, there are slicers in this game. And they're it's they're very mild compared to their um Genesis counterparts. Matter of fact, they're much easier to dodge, and when you do dodge them, they just can't take life anymore and self-destruct. I kid you not. <laughs> but then again, Eggman is on a quote-unquote budget, so they're probably not as, you know, effective as they once were. And like the bubbles, not all of them have spikes. Only the red ones do. The fact that he had enough money to color them is kind of questionable, though. Not really good with your finances, are you, Eggman? I am a finance major, I can help you. Anyway, um, <laughs> that was Act 1. Again, my favorite act for the zone, and we are going to go for the special stage once again. Hopefully, I will get it this time. If not, I will have to do some mad editing. <laughs> editing! I hate this place, I hate this place, I hate this place, I hate this place. So yeah, you need 99 rings, not 100. I'm not even gonna go for every ring. Fingers. Pass it. I got scared. <laughs> oh, these bumpers, they scare me. Oh my god, baby Q. Fingers. Okay. Um, next area. <sighs> Gosh. You know, let's try to get the bumper area over with. I don't like this place. Fingers. <sighs> Do I even want to risk the 15? Cause I'm, I probably wasted more time trying to get that. <laughs> Fingers. I meant to play the victory jingle as I was going out. <laughs> Son of a gun. Oh well. It's just that one area too. The other areas, are, they're not that bad. It's just that this one stank bumper happy area. Ugh, I hate it so much. Escape the cog trap. Oh, Supersonic would be so useful in this zone. Let me act. Well, in zone actually. <laughs> So there are basically a bunch of cogs spinning around, right round, and there's actually some you can actually spin, you have to spin manually. Uh, 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 uh. Interesting to note, the soundtracks, they sound diff a little bit different between um, versions. Like the Wii, I guess it has a different 
different type of sound based chip I suppose because it sounds a little more Genesis like than this one does and I actually prefer the Wii version over the PlayStation 3 version the only reason I'm playing the PlayStation 3 version for this is because I was too lazy to set up my Wii I admit it cheap at all. I thought it was going to send me all the way back. I would have been highly upset. Okay, I've actually never been this way before. Rings! I need you! Mad slicers. I hate it. Go, 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 go. Run, 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 run. Okay. Thought we'd get hit there. <laughs> oh, fork. Are you serious? <laughs> wow. It's just taunting me. Alright, so I'm gonna try to get it in the third act, but um Yeah. Crap. Alright, impending doom. This one has a big giant howdy do wall chasing you the entire time. Well, certain sections. It can be a little tricky at times, but it's not too bad. <sighs> Dang it. that part was coming up, but I didn't react fast enough. Son of a gun. Shield will be very helpful. No. I'm just gonna stand here. <laughs> <laughs> no. 
You guys suck. Yep. That's what I get for being greedy. Oops. We have enough rings. I like how the wall slows down to give me a chance. <laughs> a very kind of you, wall. I really do appreciate that. Okay, um, I'm actually gonna do something different. Instead of moving on to the boss, I'm actually going to go back and get the Chaos Emerald because it's going to bother me. So, I'll be right back. It's the thing with these special stages in um, the Sonic 4 Saga, the difficulty spike is ridiculous. It makes no sense whatsoever. And it's not so much the difficulty, it's the design, really. It's kind of icky. Icky is a terrible way to describe it. But I don't know how to say it. It's all because of this place right here. I hate it. Penis! 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 I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Okay. Whew. Okay. Now. The other rooms. This room is probably the easiest. It just takes a minute to get the rings because of all these breakable diamonds. But it's really not that bad. Only gold in here is <laughs> right there. You gotta work to actually get out though. Simple enough. Okay, there's one more area. Penis! Ugh. I don't need that many rings either. Yep. Okay. Hush! I got the emerald.
You know what? Let's just show them off. Just to get some shickles. I'll be right back. Ooh, got a trophy. But again, I'll be right back. Okay, so, um, apparently it takes you directly to the boss you haven't done. Um, I never knew that. Oh well. I guess I won't be showing him off. At least not yet. I have an idea for that, actually. So don't worry, I will show him off. Okay, I got stuck. Ah, shoot. See, with this boss... You can actually hit the bubble capsules, but they pop into mini Eggman. And you can't pop them this time. Which is weird. Completely opposite of, you know, <laughs> the boss is based off of. And I just don't care. I usually just go in blindly and just wail on him till he, you know, he goes to pinch mode. Screw playing it safe. Okay, so in pinch mode, we're chasing him! Yay! Because we all know these are fun. Whoops. Oh, interesting thing to note the rings in Sonic 4 go off S Sonic Rush logic, in that the more times you get hit. Oh, whoa, what the freak? The more times you get hit. Lost my train of thought. Ah, crap. Whoa! <laughs> the more times you get hit, the farther your rings will fly with each hit. Yeah, I don't know why. Well, then again, Dimps did, you know, develop this. And this game is really based off the Sonic Rush engine, just without, you know, the whole boost. That's not brought into. Sonic games until Sonic Unleashed, even though Sonic Unleashed was released before this game, but canon says this game happened first. So, yeah. Oh crap, I'm in the corner again. I'm in the corner again. Oh! Huh? What? what? Oh, I hit him enough times. Okay. <laughs> so, I was like, what's going on? Let's try this again. I usually don't suck at this part. There we go. No. Oh, fork. Wait. What the? F I didn't know it could bounce back. I what? Anyway, that was Mad Gear Zone. And a Chaos Emerald <laughs> excerpt. So. There's actually a cutscene that plays right after this, so I'm gonna mute my mic. What well, happens? It's just dang how Sonic just pulled a rocket out of nowhere. Well, he didn't really. If you notice the symbol on the um, rocket, you'll know where he got it from. Which is that's a clue as to how the next part of the saga will go. But anyway, now we can go to the X Station Zone. Which is... Yeah. But, um, that's the final zone of the game, actually. So, we will head there next time. Thank you for watching, and I will see you then.